What's up guys? Today we're watching season 5, episode 1 of Breaking Bad. So, we are starting a new season and I'm so excited because the ending of the last one was like we're finally, we're free of Gus in a way. Because apparently someone, someone in my comments said that we're still like involved with someone maybe? Like, I don't know. I don't know how that's gonna like play into it. I'm gonna see, obviously. But, you know, Gus is gone, Walt and Jesse blew up the lab, and it's like they have no trace of them doing that whatsoever, and Walt did end up poisoning Brock, and Jesse doesn't know, and it's like, I low-key, I wonder if Jesse's ever gonna find out, but like, I low-key feel like he won't, but yeah i'm just excited to get into this season and i want to start it so i guess let's just get into it Whoa, what happened there it's my birthday yeah well happy birthday what happened to him he grew his hair back and everything and like was that supposed to be like an explosion kind of thing? Business. You know, I was in Boston once. Boston in a little town called Swampscott, which is right outside of Boston. It's kind of near New Hampshire, right? Great science museum. Excuse me. Oh, so that dude was the one that he was there for? I got the word this won't wind up crossing the border. Is that the dude who gave him the gun? And ow, my cat is biting me. Ow, look. If you're gonna sit in my lap, you're not gonna bite me. Happy birthday, Mr. Lambert. Didn't even say thank you. Oh shit. What are we needing a gun for now? What the hell? It feels like a lot of time has passed. And it's like, where is everyone? Who's here? Spring is dead. He was blown up along with some person from some Mexican cartel, and the DEA has no idea what to make of it. Thank God we're getting like a flashback. I want to know what happened. <music> Got to get rid of all the evidence. What? The flower? <music> Gotta get rid of the lily of the valley too. You don't have the TV on, seriously? Uh, no, sorry. I... You, you didn't tell him about Mr. Fring? Um, he knows. Yeah, he knows. He even took me to his restaurant one time. Just just like totally toying with the guy. Just like, I got my eye on you, like that. They, they figure... Oh wait, did he not know that Hank brought him there? They, they, they figure it's over. Hmm. Like, when this hits the news, Uncle Hank is, is gonna be a hero. Yeah. I, I mean, even more so than before. <laughs> Seriously. Well, don't you think I rate a, a low, at least? Hello. Well, I mean... I don't know how I would act if, like, this whole situ- Like, how this whole situation went down. I don't know how I would act after that. So... I don't know. 
know, some kind of mild relief that I'm alive. I am relieved, Walt. Are you, though? Scared. Scared of what? You. Betty didn't expect that one. But I mean, how, how else is she really supposed to feel after all of that? What else? Hank's in that underground lab. Wow. Loving these angles. Okay. Oh, did Walt like forget something down there or something? It already. Tell me I told you so. Get it out of your system before you need like dialysis or something. It's exactly like better constraints. Maybe a camera? I have no idea what that would have been. Come on. Come on, you be nice. Just be nice. Come on, hey. Hey! Mike! It's Gustavo. He's dead. Oh no. What is Mike doing? Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold up, hold up! Get out of my way, kid! What? Oh, shit. Yeah, he saved his own life. One life. more word! Mike! Mike! If you kill him, you're gonna have to kill me. Come on! Oh, God. What is he gonna say? Gus kept cameras on us at the lab, at the laundry. God only knows where else. And of course, when I say us, I'm including you. Oh, wait, yeah, the surveillance shit. And wouldn't it be at his business? Get to it before we do. You son of a bitch. Mike, it's all on tape somewhere, or a hard drive. Where? Where did he keep it? Yeah, come on, Mike. You'll be in jail too. What? Keys, scumbag. It's the universal symbol for keys. So now they're teaming up in a way so they all don't get caught. They're too late. If this is the episode where they're all caught. Oh yeah. We're boned. Who's sneaking in? And so should you. It's just a matter of time. Mike, where is the laptop? What the hell difference does it make? They got it. End of story. How does Walt think he's going to get it? hours a day by the police there's no way you're getting it out of there who said that we have to get it out of there what are you gonna do that room what about a magnet you want to commit a whole other crime just to get this bomb of yours into bomb. evidence who said bomb i said a device yeah what an about incendiary like a device one no one's gonna listen to jesse what about a magnet? What magnet? What about it? Finally, listen to him.
he tried. Unless he thinks that's a good idea. So what do you think? Expensive. Back to the fucking junkyard. Alright. Do you want to talk money? Step into my office. They are really going through with it, and they listen to Jesse. I'd appreciate it if you could spot me my share. I'll, I'll pay you back. Yeah, whatever. I didn't know he was out of money, or was that another lie? Is that a serious question? Mike, this is a three-man job. The only way I know it won't work for sure is if we don't have you. I love Jesse and Mike's bond. But if it ends up getting Mike killed, I'm gonna be mad. Come in. Oh. Get in. Close the door. Saul doesn't need to run anymore, too, so he's back. The tend to rile you up, uh, the police, they may call. Let me, let me back up a little, can I... Can I sit down? We need an explanation. Sorry? Ted is dead? No, no. He, he just woke up. So he's not dead, okay. I thought he totally died from that with how they like ended it and we haven't seen shit about it since until now. Nice. Tools, keys, plates in your head, uh, artificial hips. Uh, check your pockets for me one more time, please. Oh, wait, yeah, they're about to test it. Imagine if you had metal in you and they turned it on. Cross, don't yank the drive shaft through the floor. How much power is it gonna take? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, that did it. Yes. So it, it works. Yeah, bitch! Magnets! Oh! <laughs> Good idea, Jesse. Hell of a noise. There goes your element of surprise. Won't matter. 60 seconds, we'll be gone. Wow. The fact that they're coming up with this shit, like, this quick. Is it gonna happen this episode? Fine, I'm just finishing up. Come on in. We are going to have you eating solid food in a day or two. I bet you money. That's wonderful. All right. Bro. That happened to Ted. Can you hear me? Yes. I bet he's, like, terrified of her right now. Family. I swear to you. Please. He really thinks that she was trying to kill him. I mean, what else would you think from that, you know? But... Good. That's all you gotta say to that man? Not like, I'm sorry. So they really are doing it this episode. Wow. I 
I feel like something is bound to fuck up. Like, I'm scared. If they get a look at any kind of footage and they see, like, partially their face and shit, Walt got glasses and a thing. Do you not think that they would recognize that, maybe? Pool? Hi, is this close enough? It'll work. Since they amped it up a lot and shit, it has to work, right? It's working, okay. I please actually work though. Like that part worked, but Bro. Let's get out of here. Just And look at what you did. Someone's gonna have to get out and push the truck back. So they made it out of there. No paperwork on the truck, the magnet, or the batteries. Untraceable salvage, all of it. Made sure of that too. So he was smart about it. Okay. Answer, man. Did all that even work just now? Yes. It worked. Not supposed to take that on faith. Yeah. How are we supposed to know it worked? If they show up at your door. Because I say so. You're one cocky bitch. Seven three three two one. Fring Gustavo. Samsung laptop computer damaged. Glass screen is broken and in pieces. Bag still sealed. Okay, that's what they wanted. Huh. Check it out. That's not on the manifest. Oh no. Oh no. What? They might have just made something worse. Cut Panicky a check so he can pay off the IRS. Again, not taking sides, but she really was trying to protect you. How's Walt gonna feel? Yeah, he seems like quiet. Yeah, that's what I told her. She said no. And you didn't argue the point. You didn't think to contact me. <laughs> he tried to save his ass, but Walt's like, no, you should have fought for it. $122,000 of my money to a man who had been sleeping with my wife. <sighs> She's my client. Doesn't look good. Told me that kid would wind up in the hospital. You don't take that thing and get the hell out of here. You and me, we're done. Ew. And he's listening. What are you? Come on. Hey. Hey. Or not. Or not. Um. We're done. When I say we're done. Okay. Yeah, they're still in business. He's scary. I heard what happened to Ted. He's not gonna talk. Why? Why does he seem so like calm about it now? I forgive you. Oh? 
I thought he was about to be more threatening. And that's the end of the episode. Okay, okay. Bro. What was the start of this season? Like, I thought... I thought that we were gonna, like, catch up from the first scene, like, by the end of the episode. But I guess that's just, like, by the end of the season. But, like... I'm still so surprised that Ted fucking survived that. Like, I thought he was dead. And then they waited a bit to even bring it up. But we know he's alive. He don't look too well. But he's he's gonna heal and everything. And he looked terrified of Skylar. And Skylar didn't even apologize for it. Which is, like, mind-blowing to me. But it's, like, the switch up with Walt's, like, composure this episode... It's like he looks so threatening and everything. So he threatens Saul. I thought he was going to threaten Skylar, but he's like, I forgive you. But it's like, what now? He needs more money. Unle like, they still have the bit like underneath the house and everything, but I don't know how much that is. So it's like, what are you going to do? I mean... You still have the car wash and that's like bringing in money too so i don't know maybe they might not start like cooking again but i'm so happy mike is alive i was kind of worried that mike was actually gonna try and shoot walt and jesse but they had to team up this episode and it's like can we believe that jesse gave a plan and it somewhat worked out but whenever they were, you know, looking at the evidence and shit, what happened with the damn frame thing? I swear to God, if that's something that gives them away, they just like fuck themselves, bro. Like we thought it went a good way, but it, that could have literally made it worse. And I hope that's not the case. But it was like a pretty, I don't want to say slow first episode. It it kind of was, but I mean, I still loved this episode. I'm like, I want to know how, in the first scene, Walt grew back his hair, but he looked rough. And maybe, I was going to say maybe the cancer came back and it's like, he, doesn't he like still have it, but he's in remission or something? I don't know. If that's the case, I didn't know that his hair would grow back. That's just besides the point. I don't know how that shit works. But I'm ready to see what's going to happen in episode two. So I guess come back for episode two.